your question is differentiate with respect to x see that what they have given 1 by root over 2x minus 5 here they have given 6 by cube root of 2 minus 3x so first we will rewrite how so this is nothing but what 1 by 2x minus 5 and the power is 1 by 2. Now, bring these two upward. So, therefore, it will be 2x minus 5 and the power is minus 1 by 2. Now, rewrite this. So, here it is 6. So, therefore, we will write it as 6 by or here we will write 6 by 2 minus 3x and the power is 1 by 3. Bring this 2 up. So it will be what? 6 into 2 minus 3x and the power is minus 1 by 3. Now, so for here we will go for our chain rule chain rule. In chain rule, whatever there is in bracket, that we will take it as A. This is your A and the bracket and the power. That is your B. Same way here, in bracket, it is your A and the bracket and the power is your b. So therefore here what we will do? Here we will go for d by dx of a into d by dx of b. So now, how we will rewrite it as? See that? d by dx of 2x minus 5, that is your a into d by dx of 2x minus 5 and the power is minus 1 by 2. When we are differentiating b, we should not differentiate the bracket 1. Why means we have already differentiated here. Now, this we will go for our scalar multiple. And this will, will go for our power function. In power function, if we get x to the power of n, if you differentiate, it will be what? n x to the power of n minus 1. In scalar multiple, we have to split it. Now, so therefore, here we will get d by dx of here 2 is there, 2 you can write here, x minus 5 is there, here d by dx of x to the power of 0 into, now this is in the form of this, so that only we have to write minus 1 by 2, here it will be 2x minus 5, here minus 1 by 2 minus 1. Now differentiate this. This is x. That means we will get 1. So this is 2. Minus 5 into 0 is 0. And here comes minus 1 by 2. And this will be 2x minus 5. If you take the LCM, you will get minus 1 minus 2 by 2. That is equal to minus 3 by 2. Now, solve this. 2 and 2 will go out. So, this will be minus 1. So, now your answer is minus of 2x minus 5 and the power is minus 3 by 2. That is equal to. Now, 
this is minus that means we have to bring it down we have to bring it down so it will be minus 1 by e and this will be 3 means it's a cube and this 1 by 2 is a square so therefore we will get here 2x minus 5 cube and 1 by 2 shows your square root. So this is your answer for this question. Now, comes here. Here what happened? We got this. The so same we have to do it. Now, so this is 6. So 6 we will write outside. Now, d a d by dx of 2 minus 3x into d by dx of b now. So, 2 minus 3x and the power is minus 1 by 3. So, here we will go for our scalar multiple. So, this is your this. And this will be your d by dx of this 2 will come here. So this is constant. Here we will write x to the power of 0. Minus 3 d by dx of x into. Now solve this as is t in form of x to the power of n. So therefore we will get minus 1 by 3. Here it will be 2 minus 3x. Here it will be minus 1 by 3 minus 1. So it will be minus 4 by 3. Now solve this. So this is 0. 6 into 0. Minus 3. And this will be into minus 1 by 3. And here it will come as 2 minus 3x and the power is minus 4 by 3. Now solve this. So this is 3. So 3 and 3 will go out. Minus and minus will become plus. So here you will get 6 only. So this will be like this. 6 into 2 minus 3x and power is minus 4 by 3. Now, this is minus. That means it will go down. So, now it will be 6 by 2 minus 3x and power is 4 by 3. What does it mean? It means that 2 minus 3x to the power of 4 and it will be a cube root of that. That means we can rewrite it as 6 by this will be your cube root of 2 minus 3x and the power is 4. So this is your answer for this question.